All right, guys, so we are down in Florida, and we went to an insane mower shop. The full tour is coming up in this video. But check out this water. This water is crystal clean, a beautiful ocean where we were down here in Florida on the Gulf side, Sarasota, Florida. So let's get into the video. All right, guys, what's up? We're here in Sarasota, Florida, which is uh, an hour south of my, uh, not Miami, um, Tampa. And so we're down here just for a few days. Um, I, if I take a few days off, it's always in January when things are quiet and I let the customers know about it, you know, all that mess. So we're down here and we wanted to stop by, maybe you're gonna have to hold my hand. We wanted to stop by a mower shop they have here and they have an awesome mower shop. It's called Mowers Inc. <laughs> Over here at this mower shop, look, there's his uh, logo for Mowers Inc. It's called Mowers Inc. Man, they do walker mowers, they sell trailers, they do skag mowers, they got Bradley mowers, they got Ventrac, they got Toro, they got, I mean, everything. Skag, Red Max, Echo, uh, they have um, Wright mowers. Oh, they got a lot of brands, but see, look, they got, there's the Patriot. You see, there's two of those uh, walker R21s down there, just like mine. Look at this uh, stand on. Here's the windstorm. But look at this place, it's awesome. They got this fold up mower, the 96 inch Toro there. Look, they even have this Bradley mower. They got a Tiger Cat. We'll have to. They got. Oh, they have Hustler mowers too. I'll have to show you more stuff. I'll have to go inside in a minute. Here's the Toro 96. Here is the. Uh, Oh, I kind of like this one better. The Super 104. I think it has a diesel on it and everything. All right, guys. So, look at this 104. I'm actually not 100% sure if it had the diesel on it or not, but it doesn't really matter. That's got 37 horse Vanguard on it. Um, sorry, I'm getting a phone call. I'll have to call him back in a minute. I'm getting a phone call, but, uh, uh, man. This, uh, this mower shop was insane. It was so awesome. We went there. Um, as you can see, and I showed you the X1, I showed you the Raptor. Um, here's you got your Skag Turf Tiger 2. Um, oh, we got one of the new Cheetahs here. My dream mower, Skag Cheetah 60 inch. So it's not really very applicable for my yards, but y'all know I want one of those in the future just to have it. Look, he's got the full line of Red Max, 6,500 all the way up, 8550. He's got all the weed eaters, edgers, stuff like that. Um, River wanted to knock down all those blower tubes, and so <laughs> it stopped from doing that. I apologize if it's just a tad shaky, because um, I did speed this up just a hair, just so I wouldn't, you know, so I wouldn't make it too long, or, um, you know, I just wanted to keep it moving fast pretty fast so I wouldn't you know bore anyone or anything like that um so man he's got these Toro sprayers he's got the full line of Toro stuff look he's got Shindawa back here so there's like the Shindawa version of the 8010 he's got some other Shindawa blowers he got all the Shindawa um hedge trimmers weed eaters um he's got the new line of the Toro stuff I mean this shop has basically everything you want this is one of the coolest things check this out free fountain drinks to any customer and yes you are one i mean that's a i think all mower shops should take note of that um if i had a mower shop i would definitely be offering something like that there's just you offer a little something to the customer and they feel they feel like it's a you know it's a win-win um you know giving relationship and so big kudos to mower zinc on you know even just doing something like that fountain drink you know it's just amazing i'm you know i imagine when uh landscaper customers come here in the summer and it's super hot and they're able to get a cold drink man where, where do you think they're gonna go next time they need a mower you know what i mean huh huh makes perfect sense in my mind so look he's got right standard zk look he's even got these spartan mowers these uh battleship little mowers they're super cool man he's got i mean he, he's got everything here that you could need um 
like I told you, he has tra they sell trailers and everything. Chippers, um, pressure washers, and that little stand-on little track loader. I like that thing. I need one of those. Uh, look at these, the new new edition of the Hustler Raptor. Y'all know years ago I had a little one for doing some of my uh, backyards and stuff, and it was great. It was re a really good mower. I never had a single issue with it. Um, oh, look, he's got the whole... He's got the full line of uh, Hustler mowers. He's got the full line of Echo over here. Every, anything you could want. You guys that are in, uh, you know, anywhere within driving distance you know of this uh, shop make sure you consider them make sure you check it out great prices great products oh yeah i meant to mention there's something that i purchased and i you'll have to stay tuned in the next video because i bought a piece of equipment while i was here and uh and i'll give you one hint it's the color red um so i won't give you any more hints than that but i bought something and it's red and so next video you will learn about that but so i did uh, i did purchase something when i was here but man look at this he's got he's got a big uh it's like a chainsaw room up here he's got the climbing gear over here on your left climbing ropes and all that um look at this carved sculpture that's awesome um he has basically as far as i know he has every single model of echo chainsaw that they have um, you know, as far as I can tell. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna, it's cool. It's just like its own little chainsaw room showing y'all kind of a bird's eye view here of the dealership. So awesome. Um, and there's even some of this that you can't see from up here. Um, we'll go in the back and I'll show you the warehouse and stuff in a minute. Um, he actually, uh, he makes some of his own products and there's just so many cool things that they're up to. So like I said, you guys and within driving distance, make sure you uh, check this place out. He was even telling me that every year for their open house, which is in April sometime, there's even people that fly in and stuff to go to it. He said they give away a couple mowers every year. Um, it's a big deal. So, um, yeah, so super awesome, super awesome stuff. Um, I'm going to show you in the back here in a second. That's where I'm headed. Um Man, those are some nice right standards. Look, they even got a Ryan sod cutter right there, which is super cool. They got push blowers over there. I mean, they there's really <laughs> they got generators. I mean, what else? There's nothing else that you could even use in your business that they don't have at this at this mower shop. So, I think I think that's super cool to have somewhere that's almost like a one stop shop thing. Like I said, there's guys they buy trailers here, the whole bit. Here's some uh stuff got fixed um you see this is kind of where you see they got all kinds of belts and stuff we're kind of walking back through the repair area check out all these red max blowers that were going out on an order for a big company wow that's a few blowers there <laughs> those are the 8550s i believe and uh so they'll be ready to move some leaves this is kind of from what i understand where they work on like their two-stroke equipment and they have it all organized in different areas work on different things Look at these Altos, 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 um, tracked mowers. I remember seeing those at the Expo, and uh, they are super cool. And apparently they're a dealer for those as well. Um, this is all stuff that's waiting to get fixed, which is super awesome. They got to always have an influx of stuff. They do a lot of business. They do great business. Um, really cool stuff. You got a grasshopper over there. Um, you know, look at this. It's got the big old diesel on that thing. It's a serious mower. Um, it was so cool just the fact that he was, the owner was willing to uh, let me show all this on camera, which is very nice of him. He gave me permission to do that. He even walked us back through here the first time, and uh, I wasn't filming then. Um, I wanted to ask him, you know, what you know, what I could or couldn't film or anything, and he was very open about it. He's like, yeah, you can show whatever. Um, there's a few products that they make y'all have to check out too, and I did not get permission to uh, show those on camera, so I didn't. Um, but anyway, this is just some more new mowers that are already sold that are waiting to like go out. Check out some, another company, one landscape company from what I understand bought all those right standards. Check out this new Toro 4000, man. They, Toro is kind of making them look more aggressive now. You know, my dad has that uh, 3000 series that he bought last year. And as you can see, they're making them more aggressive looking. I don't know if that's good or bad, but um, I mean, I kind of like the, the older last year's model. 
me personally of the of the Toro, but anyway, I mean these are cool. Um, I like the aggressive styling. I just don't. I don't know. I don't know if it's completely necessary, but I think it, it's neat. It's cool. Um, then you got some more of these Spartan mowers, and then uh, oh yeah, he's also a Yanmar uh, tractor dealer as well. Look, you got a bunch more of these Spartan mowers are ready to go out. Um, it's got some more stuff over here. I think this is stuff that's fixed. It's waiting to get picked up. Oh yeah, they also sell these trailers. Look at this. this is one with uh, no rivets on the outside. And they have like a really cool custom floor, heavy duty floor inside. So, so many cool things. Um, so y'all be sure to check out Mowers Inc.